so many bots on YouTube. It's weird. I try blocking a few words too, but they just keep coming in with different ones. I don't know if there's a, uh, a moderator bot out there that like automatically adds it for you or something like the words that they're saying. Will this take me up there? Uh, hmm. Hold on. Uh, now we need to figure out a way how to get up there. Other than just fast traveling there. Maybe that's the best route. Yeah. Uh, unless... Let's see if we can go up this way. Yeah, we might be able to go up this way. There we go. Uh, I'm going to backtrack. I'm going to go up there and then I'll come back this way. Black Iron Bridge. Da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. All right, hop off. What do we need to do is just kill like three of these. Two more. That ability is very excessive. <laughs> I do not mind it at all, though. Not one bit. these down throw that up there because I always do that right after maybe bump these down we'll try it like that three four five ah oh, shoot four five six hmm. maybe Yeah, let's try this. So that way, one, two, three, then we have four, five. We enter the trance with four. Because sometimes one, two, and three might be left over, even though the trance is available again. Looks like a good setup. Thank you. See, like right there, I should have done that one first, but that's okay. We hit that, and then hit this. Just remember that whatever works for someone else might not work for you. 
Yeah, that's one thing I like about MMOs today, unless if you want to be like the top of the top, tippity top, like damage, DPS, highest, maximum damage, no breathing time, always hit, 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 critical, critical. Like, unless if you want to be like that, like most MMOs nowadays are like, yeah, play how you want. Still do damage. Like. I've always been the type of person that like, even though I shouldn't all the time, I'll still look up like a, uh, a guide on like, what should my rotation be while I'm leveling? What should this be? And meanwhile, I was just like, eh, you probably don't have to. Is it tailored for casual content? Yeah, that's the nice thing. It's a great thing, actually. Good assortment of difficult content, too. It's what you need. A nice balance. forget when you go down in levels like you miss out on some abilities or if you play like older content you miss out on like all your top pins like it downscales your stuff The game just continues to grow on me. Like right now, I'm definitely in that like, I wanna play more phase. Like I go to work and I wanna watch like Final Fantasy like 14 uh, videos. And then when I get home, I'm like, oh, yes, time to play some more. <laughs> I don't know. I'm starting to rethink my idea about the secret world this weekend. Because I might want to play some Final Fantasy the whole time. I'm just so nervous that that game's gonna die and then I'm gonna regret it. I'm gonna regret not being able to play it if I miss out. Because I've heard so many good things. I don't know. I was about to be like, I should have worn a jacket in chat. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! 
Am I supposed to have an ability that breaks me out of that? are like getting tired. Oh. I still have a good amount of time tonight though. Question. If so, if I hit level like, say I hit level 90, right? And then I get some cool armor that I can wear and I glamour that armor. If I switch classes, will I lose out on wearing that glamour? So if I'm like a level 90 summoner, but then I go to a level. 30 rogue can i no longer wear that assortment that glamour or does it not matter at that point if it's class specific yes okay so as long as it's a generic one what if it's a generic uh clothing but it just requires a higher level. Or is there even such a thing? Maybe there's not a thing. Do I need the torn pages? I'm gonna take it anyways. Every time I have that stuck in my head when I play Final Fantasy. Lord Commander Seat. Someday I aspire to be a Lord Commander. 
I aspire to be a Lord Commander, Lieutenant, First Class, uh, Captain, Sir, Sir Lord Commander, First Class, Captain, Cassis, Colonel. That's the exact title I want. Watch out! That one's dead. instant some of these abilities are nice or commander's seat is no longer sealed is it seat lord commander sir lord commander rebel alliance is attacked Is there a slash cold? Ah. The hell? Oh my god, that was a steam message? Even I didn't get a steam message. You know, I can't wait to, <laughs> I keep saying this, but I can't wait to move to Crystal. I want to see the RP that people do. I want to bask in all of the ERP, I mean RP that I possibly can. <laughs> I can only imagine. I can. Well, actually, I don't have to imagine. Let's go. Oh, one on the gear question from before. You know, I kind of don't mind being a dragon boy right now. But at the same time, I want to be a big, t bulky. I, I don't know if I've ever seen a uh, Gaedolin. Is that how you say it? Geodon? I don't know if I've ever seen one as a summoner before. I don't really look the part, but hey, I'm all I'm all down for that. Rose are pretty rare, rare, to be honest. Is that what most people say? 
Yeah, I feel like most people want to be a cat boy, cat girl, bunny girl. What, um, uh, what race are you? Valafel. La 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 la. I'm gonna skip this because it's not like a huge deal. Cat girl for story, but usually cat boy. Okay. <laughs> so wait, do you cast whirling goal, hide behind debris? Oh my god, I have him as a mount. So do you change, uh... So do you change to a cat girl when you're playing the story, but then to a cat boy? Um, when you're not playing the story? I mean, yeah, I guess that. Oh no, oh, I messed up. No, I tried to get out. I'm probably gonna die, but well, maybe. Level up, too. Oh, nice. It dropped us back right here. Sweet. Sixty-one. Did I get any new abilities at sixty-one? I think my next big ability, yeah, sixty-four. I get uh, sixty-two. I get rune. Four. Then sixty-six. I get another one. Seventy is a big one too. Seventy is when I get the helmet. That's gonna be sick. I'm not even gonna bother. I'm just gonna go over here. Okay, let's hand this quest in. And after we hand in this quest, I'm going to. Go up 
top and in my main quest and then after I hand in the main quest then I'm gonna go over to uh to take the chocobo over to the other three quests that I need to hand in search for Thancred oh, nice by the time I get there I'll be able to fly our chocobo convictory yes I'm gonna grab a drink real quick while we're flying so I will be right back I even turn this on here be <sighs> okay chat I'm back all right let's hand these in and my drinks behind me Grab my drink. 
Okay. So. Now we can fly. Much better. Search for Thancred. Is that him right there? Oh, full heretic. That's it. We. Oh my god. I would have been so mad if I came all the way out here just to talk to him for a minute and then just go all the way back. Oh my god. But luckily now I can fly. Jesus, that thing is huge. needs to put his jacket on. Welcome, welcome. Ooh. Find yourself an empty seat and I'll be with you in a moment. A maid with a voice line. Okay. Here, a mug on the house. Let's get some color back in them cheeks. Freed food will be a bit longer than usual. We've got a lot of hungry folk to feed, what with the conference and all. Oh, so many people with cause to celebrate. To think there could be peace in our time. After all them years of fighting. When I heard about the conference, I knew I had to come. I knew I had to be here. To do my bit. My husband, he... He died fighting the dragons, you see. And here we are. About to break bread with him. Poisoned. Sleep now. Sleep. Sleep and leave us to our affairs. This was never your fight. They told me he walks in Halone's halls. Him and the rest of his unit. They told me the same. I 
I expect they think it's comforting. Every time I come, I cry. I cannot bear to remember, but to forget would be a thousand times worse. Yet that is what they would have us do. Accept this truth for the sake of peace. Bury the past and look to the future. But he was my future. My flesh and blood. My heart. Is this it? We're the only ones with the courage to oppose this madness. Cowards, a lot of them. They think only of the prize, of the peace Sir Emmerich promises them. They know in their hearts it's a lie, but they go along with it anyway, desperate fools. But not I. Not I! I see the worm that killed my brother in my dreams every night. And I will not rest until he lies broken at my feet. Him and every last one of his accursed kin. All this nonsense about kings of eld, as if I care what they did or didn't do, makes no difference to me and mine. Have the dragons sued for peace in a thousand years? Are they bollocks? It's a bloody ruse is what it is, and Sir Emmerich and the rest of them bloody fallen for it. But what can we do? They believe, and naught we can say will ever change their minds. Whether we like it or not, man and dragon will come together at Falcon's Nest, and all will be forgiven. Forgiven and forgotten. <gasps> no. I will not let that happen. Oh. They will remember the true face of the enemy. I will show it to them. And we will rise up against them once more. This is no time for napping. Sorry, I like taking you? naps. Good. Come with me. We have a crisis on our hands. Brothers and sisters, do not be fooled by the honeyed words of the Dravarnians. The peace they promise is but a prelude to slaughter. Remember your husbands and wives never returned from war. Your children torn apart by fang and claw. All your loved ones show no mercy. Does not your heart cry out for vengeance? Your blood boil at the injustice? Remember the face of your enemy, brothers and sisters. Remember it and strike back! You there, don't just stand around gawping. Do something, man. Stop her. Yes, yes, my lord. See? See here, 
the true nature of the Highborn. With lies and deception, they lead us to our doom. And dare we raise our voices in dissent? Death is our reward. This is the choice they have given us, brothers and sisters. Death by Dragon's Fang, or death by Nobleman's Command. Death to all we hold dear! I spit on your choices, Nobleman! You will take no more from me! No more! No more! Damn! Just firing at her, shooting her down. What have you done? I, I only did as you ordered, my lord. What? They're about to overthrow him. That is not good. I gave no such order. I, I did not. I I never meant for anyone to with the falcon's nest we get are we getting like uh their information Can i change glamour plates here no i can't forget where this is at uh, and grid what say you blah 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 forgot to enable this again Lucia. Search for Honoroid. Yeah, it'll probably be easier if I just do this. Quest logo. Where art thou? Quest logo. Oh, there it is. <laughs> to you on a on a is that you my lord you you seem rather flustered because of you you imbecile 
What in the seven hells happened to you? My... My apologies. Some few of the guests expressed a wish to leave, and I implored them to stay. It would seem they took issue with my request. Oh, gods forgive me. If I had only been more careful with my words. D do not blame yourself, my lord. I know. I know that you and your brother have Ishgard's best interests at heart. That poor woman. She lives in the past, clinging to the memories of the lost. But the future holds so much promise, so much joy. And you, you know that better than any. Calm yourself. The boy will live. But it's imperative we get him inside and into the care of a Kairujin without delay. Oh, we were so close! Why does it all have to fall to pieces? Don't they want to live in peace? Don't they want to be happy? We all want the same thing! And still, still, it falls to pieces! Tell me, what, what was I supposed to do? Hm? Someone, anyone, tell me, what was I supposed to do? Stop looking to others. You make your choice and you live with the consequences. Damn. And what would you know about consequences? You who always know just what to say and just what to do. Your every deed is greeted with a round of applause. Oh, shit. You know nothing about me. I have fought tooth and nail for the people I hold dear done everything in my power to save them and I have failed learn to live with it I have Okay, then. I'll take that one. Back to Ishgard. Ishgard. Turn this back on. Second chat.
April Fall. Uh oh. Where did it go? I have this one. I'm looking for this cable. Oh, there it is. I found it. It's hiding. Okay. Cool. That's good to try out later. All right. We are good. Uh, let's see. Voices. Speak with Ermic. Come this far, have we not? We can't give up now. Speak with Lucia. Deliver the letter to Hilda. Found Hilda. Take thy letter. George Cozier. Just hiding over here. Carried him to the manor. Always wanted to make his own choices. <laughs> I understand. I'm gonna skip this. Forgotten night. I wish I could show you our screenshot album for Rebel. Is it in the Discord? Oh, uh, okay. But some of them have spoilers. Once I catch up one day, I'll have to... I'll have to go back and look at all of it. Absolutely. If I may? 
I wish to speak with you before the Grand Malay. Proceed. How do you do it, my lord? How do you lead with such certainty when so many of our countrymen will not hear of peace with the Dravanians? Some of them hate you almost as much as the dragons themselves. They decry you as a patricide in the streets. They even tried to kill you for God's sakes. Yet still you march on undaunted where no archbishop dared to tread. What is your secret? Where do you find the strength? For centuries, our nation has been punished for the sins of our forefathers. If our punishment is to end, I believe we must right the wrongs of antiquity and move forward as a nation united. Needless to say, my father did not share this opinion. He did not believe the people strong enough to bring about their own deliverance, trusting only in himself. Tyranny seemed to him the only solution. But I have faith in the people, Lord Amanalain. I have faith that they will weather this storm and overcome every trial we set before them. Many have fought and died to see this blight upon our nation's history cleansed, and I would not let their sacrifices be in vain. Though we invite reprisals, the risk is worth the reward. I want to believe, I do. Lord Commander, through my careless orders, a pall has been cast over these proceedings and I beg the opportunity to make amends. I, Amanalain de Forton, do hereby request leave to take part in the Grand Malay. Who am I to deny such a heartfelt plea? We would be honored to have you join the fray, my lord. You will take charge of the Ishgardian forces. For all my other responsibilities, I am still Lord Commander of the Temple Knights, and I would not soon yield this duty to another. The esteemed Sir Emmerich leading the Temple Knights and the Watch into battle along with my youngest. I could wish for no more. Then you wish for too little, my lord. There is another who might yet join the fray. An indispensable ally to whom we owe much and more. An adventurer beholden to none who nevertheless chose to champion our cause, who has shared in our suffering and in our glory. A warrior without equal, who I am privileged to call a friend. There is no one I would rather have fighting by my side. I ask this in full knowledge of your obligations and will not think less of you should you refuse. But if your conscience will allow it, might you oblige me, my friend, one more time. <sighs> Together we shall give the people a spectacle for the ages. A celebration to mark the dawning of a new era.
Uh, let's see. What's the best way? Yeah, I guess going down this. And then we'll head outside. Making good progress tonight. Yes, I'd like to return to the gates of judgment. There he is. And there's all them as well. I am ready. Let's do this. That uh, arm cloak is pretty cool. Is that me? <laughs> nice. Let all here present heed well the rules of engagement. Grand Melee is a large-scale battle in which an allied company pitted against a company of Ishgardian forces. Tactical points. Wait, is this an like a turn based? During the melee, efficiency may more combatants with fury gaze. and the glory of Ishgard. This is interesting. All is ready then. Very well. Very well. Teeny tiny person, begin. true. So going on, thigh guy. <laughs> I know. Here we go. How's Final Fantasy? I'm I'm really enjoying it so far. Been a good time. I really like my uh, classes changes that they had to uh, the summoner class. They got a, a big revamp for the latest uh, expansion. So I'm working on uh, getting Getting as far as I can. I still have a long time to go until I even reach the latest expansion. Uh, I actually have two. No. Yeah, two to go through before I even get to it. But besides that, I'm having fun. I'm enjoying it. Do you play Final Fantasy? Final Fantasy 14, at least. Mm. 
never got a chance. I know that feeling. PC is too weak, gotcha. Yeah, it's a long one. It's definitely, definitely a dedication. drive like a regular disk drive or an ssd at all to see if that made a difference not an ssd huh wow i haven't seen that to carry my entire PC. Yeah, graphics cards are, are way too expensive. Buying them outright is, is so much right now. It's not really worth it. It's almost easier or better to, uh, to almost buy a new PC. And even like swap it out sometimes. I almost had a new PC. I actually ordered one. Uh, and it was going to come with a 3080. Uh, but I wanted an i7 1100K or 1000K. And they didn't have... Uh, they actually canceled my order because they couldn't get any more chips. And they were sending me weekly updates of it <laughs> and everything. It was like 200 or no, it was like $300 off because I ordered it during Black Friday. At the time, I was also having uh, issues with my PC, but for the most part, I got a lot of that figured out. Yeah. I honestly, I think pre-builds are, are a lot, um, if, you, if somebody doesn't want to go through the hassle of building it from scratch, you know, like pre-builds today are very uh, reliable, or can be very reliable solutions. Especially if you get like a bundle. And the nice thing is you can always swap out things down the line too. Like if you buy something and you don't even you want to swap something else out, then you can do that too. Exactly. Yeah. Expects should last me for years now. That's basically where I'm at right now. Um, my PC right now, I bought back in 2016. Uh, the only problem is my motherboard, definitely within the next one or two generations of graphics cards, my, my motherboard's gonna be out of date. Um, and currently, this, this PC is not gonna be able to handle Windows 11 with their current uh, specs, which is kind of, 
a little i don't know still find it a little weird but i guess we'll see we'll see how windows 11 comes out anyways but yeah hopefully within like the next year or two i'll be in that same boat i mean i have a 2070 right now so it's not like i'm dying some games my cpu tends to be a little like almost maxing it out um i have an i7 6700k so it comes and goes Are we about to lose? I think we are. Damn, Cred's gonna take it on one on one. <laughs> okay. Damn, Cred's a little OP. That's all right. Yay. Here we go. Is this just for sport? Right now? Right? We're not like trying to kill anybody. Yeah, it's just for sport. That's what I figured. It's interesting. <laughs> Let's do this, Robon. I think I'm going to say this now, but I think once we're, our battle is done here, I'm gonna do the quick uh, change up my character looks. So that way tomorrow when we log in, we log in as the new me. Oh 
Almost there. No! Duty failed! Did I not do enough damage? No way. Ah, shit. I almost had him. God damn it. That was such a long battle, too. I'm going in very easy, and I do not care at all. Because I'm getting that done. Oh, my God. Oh. It sucks that it doesn't have to... Uh, that is a... Uh, holy crap. I'm glad they give you that option at a uh, very easy. Was that always a thing? Like difficulty options for duties? Just for instances. Oh my god, we are wiping them out. <laughs> Does it make any difference? Really? Like, game wise? For what? Um, I guess rewards or like anything like that? Or is it just like the mobs are just easier? Like that's it? Or are there like achievements, I guess? For beating it on normal? Like is there any reason not to go easy other than for the challenge? Don't hit as hard? Okay. Damn, I can't believe I had to reset that, but... I got interrupted by what? the book at them <laughs> honestly you know I wouldn't have a problem with that but that's how it actually worked I would love to see that in a cutscene like if it was uh, weapon specific and then instead of like doing a basic attack or like a normal casting ability, you just toss it. If you get close enough to auto attack, you can actually hit them with the book. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Take that.
Bring it down. Like, even this ability is pretty powerful. I will say, combat-wise, yeah, it can be pretty good for compared to Swotor. Um... But I still, I still love that story of Swotor the most. The dialogue options and all of that. It also depends on who you're playing. Swotor always has that special place in my heart. And I cannot wait for the legacy of the Sith expansion for that game to drop. I'm very excited for that and to try out the new class system ah uh, i'm definitely doing playthroughs again of characters i don't even care i gotta say sith warrior plus jedi knight uh stories are amazing Ah, they're all so good. They they all have their special uh, uniqueness to it. It's beautiful. I will say, Swotor has been getting a lot more love. And oh my god, look how, mu how much we're destroying him right now. We are wrecking him. Just got to make sure I get all these before. That's all of them, right? Whew. Yeah, player numbers have jumped. And then also um, a lot of streamers have been playing it again, too. Everybody's like on that like they won an MMO, but they don't want to play WoW anymore And I think it's gonna continue to gain to gain traction The team working on Swotor is still very small, but I think it's it's gonna stay longer than I than people anticipated And I can't wait to see the uh, uh, the new class system play styles being able to play as a Jedi Knight, but then have Sith Warrior abilities is going to be such a game changer. It's going to be so cool. Did, did he win? Then we... we... Yeah, I, I hope it does well. Very excited. You couldn't tell. <laughs> Victory is ours! Ishgard! Ishgard! Punching related ability is true. I would love to see a new play style added. Well fought! Well fought, my friend! You truly are the, the combat warrior style. of warriors. Thank the fury you were on our side. But I don't know if they ever will. I mean, it's been 10 years and they never added a new class or play or combat play style. But it's possible. <laughs> oh, my lungs are burning and I can barely stand. I didn't think I could do it, but then I did. We did. We faced the Alliance's best and together with one heart, with one purpose, we prevailed. After a thousand oh. years of hardship, of strife and bloodshed, we are strong enough to rise to any challenge, be it on the battlefield or beyond. The future holds so much promise, Not so really. much joy. 
We need only show them the way. There's really only like one storyline. I mean, you can, uh, as the game progresses, um, there's not really like factions like that. There is a faction, but, um, but yeah. It's not like, oh, uh, you're the dark side. A truly magnificent display, Sir Knight. While doubtless less than pleased, There's no alliance I am in quite Horde sure the Grand Companies are honored to have been bested by such valiant warriors. Yeah, it's not bad. The honor was ours, Your Grace. It makes it easy for creating a set path that, that everybody follows martial tradition is being upheld but different classes when the time comes <laughs> i trust you will fight alongside your brothers and sisters in the eorzean alliance with the same fervor you displayed in opposing yeah me. i note Sometimes that our friend like elected to take the field in ishgardian colors At my behest, Your Grace. If we have given offense, the blame lies with me. <laughs> Fear not, Sir Knight. It was a surprise, nothing more. And any hint of ill feeling was thoroughly dispelled by the spectacle <laughs> of our mutual friend's duel with General Rauban. I know. On the subject that doesn't of surprises, help. I could not help but marvel I know at the that passion feeling. and unity of purpose displayed by your countrymen, given the troubling reports we have received of late. I shall take that as a compliment, Your Grace. The events to which you allude are the price of change. The end of the Dragonsong War marks Same the beginning here. of a new era for our nation and for the people. High and lowborn alike, who will lead her into the future. Guild Wars 2 is getting another uh, patch or er, expansion oh, yes. in 2022. Another game. I need to try. Change is indeed a perilous thing for we who seek it and they who fear it. I shall pray for Ishgard. I love and MMOs. Fear. They're just so, like, giant. Yeah, I never got far into Guild Wars 2 either. I made a, I made a, a character off stream like a month, well, a few that months ago. Well, made for ago. a refreshing change. Congratulations and I played it for like victory, five hours, but only got to like level 10 or 15 maybe. Like that was it. These guardians certainly seem happy with themselves. I, for my part, am merely glad you did not strain anything in the process of single-handedly winning the battle for them. That game's also coming to Steam in 2022. So we'll probably see a resurgence then. Tis but a scratch, I assure you. Make that two dozen. Still... As Yestola never tires of telling me, we can but face them head on one at a time. One day at a time. One day at a time. As Mephilia would have done. There's also, um... Lord of the Rings is supposedly getting a substantial update at some point in the future. Uh, so... I mean, if they, if it gets graphical update, oh my god, I'll definitely check that out too. <laughs> so, I don't know when that is planned to happen. Yeah, yeah, Lord of the Rings Online. Um, they're actually going to make an entire new Lord of the Rings game, but they canceled that because it was going to conflict with <laughs> uh, New World, so... But again, I never watched the single movie. I've watched uh, the first two and one of the Hobbits. I was never, I personally, personally, Lord of the Rings is a little 
overrated in my opinion but i know tons and tons of people grew up on it so for me going back and trying to rewatch it has been a little bit rough um but i i i still think the the lore is good and stuff like i, I think it can do some really cool stuff so i'm still interested in it um okay so here we go we're doing this can i leave my equipment on or my clothing on my uh item on my pen oh my god i can't speak my, my uh my piece of this or do i have to get rid of that too okay here it is the final look maybe i'll try wow yeah right same <laughs> i'm good on wow ladies and gentlemen the Dragon Boy era is ending shortly. This is where we become our true form. The final moments of being a Dragon Boy or a Dragon Man. We will now become something more oh god i almost forgot my shoes wait no i took them off I, right yeah i did take them off i guess they automatically even won so now it is time for us to ascend into a a a Hey! Please hold. Hey! We are ascending into a... Into a... Into a... Into a... In to a how do i do it uh oh really Delete? Wait, how do I do this? No, I, I popped it. I did pop it. He went Psh. I have so many other characters. <laughs> Let's we'll see what happens. I did pop it though. Would it show up right there? Let me look it up.
How to use Fantasia. On the next login, maybe I have to log out and then back in. I don't know if it affects game launch. I mean, technically, I'm logging back into my character, but let's try. It'll only take a second. Yeah, it could be right since it's so busy right now too. Oh, <laughs> there it is. Yeah, that's what it was. I just needed to relog. Yeah, I can even see my character now. Okay, are we ready? How do I save my? Yeah, save my current one. Dragon boy. <laughs> All right. Here we go. All right, so I'm actually going Lalafell this time around. So, um I think we're going to go let's See, let me just hit confirm. No, I'm just kidding. I'm sorry, I can't do that. I'm sorry. I don't think I'll ever be able to. You know, I you never see Elzins either. Begin his transformation into 2013 Devil May Cry Dante. I'm actually gonna become a Viera boy. Save that. There we go. Save that for later. Very good. The true one that we become. We are becoming. Rogaden, the big boy. Known for their brawny builds and piercing eyes, the Rogaden are the largest and most rugged of Eorza's races. The majority of the realm's Rogaden belong to the Sea Wolf Clan, the Maritime people who earn their keep on or by the sea, be it as sailors, fishermen, or pirates. Comparatively, fewer in number are the Hellsguard, who are known for the more earnest demeanors and can be found working as bodyguards and smithies. Coming from an aura, Curved horns, beautifully patterned scales that characterize the aura oft give rise to speculation that members of the higher-like higher race native to the far eastern continent of Othard are in fact the progeny of dragons. This, however, has been disputed with the scholars citing several distinct differences in two races as the evidence decidedly dissimilar Roots, the first and foremost being the enhanced hearing and spatial recognition granted by the Alra's cranial projections. Right, it's not a pretty <laughs> And the second being the gross disportation dispor pro voila di disproportionate in body mass between Ari 
males and females. Again, a, wa a trait widely unseen in dragons. Whoa, I never realized that they are tiny. But yes, we are becoming one. So now we have sea wolves or hell's guard. Absolutely going hell's guard. But sea wolves, uh, long ago, no vessel or coastal village was safe from the fury of the sea wolves and the maritime brand of brutality. The mere mention of the clan was enough to strike fear into the hearts of any who drew their livelihood from the sea. Sea wolves originally hail from the island in the far, north, far northern seas where they still subsist as fishermen and women. What about a bunny boy? Eh, I don't think. I don't think I, there's too many bunny boys. I don't think I could be a bunny boy. Personally. Maybe. Maybe a second character one day. Um... But yeah, <laughs> uh, it was not until the larger scale development of Limsa and Ominsa Armada to what was appetite for the that Hell's Guard, a Hell's Guard are a Rogadian clan with the body and mind tempered with the unforgiving heart of volcanic regions they inhabit. Believing these mountains of flame to be gates of the underworld, their line has been for century has for centuries stood vigil in the to prevent the passage of souls back to the realm of the living. As the harsh environs of their homelands produce little substance, the second and third born are often sent forth from the mountain villages, with many and more making their way to the great cities. It is there that their sheer girth and steely demeanors place them in a high demand as soldiers, cell swords, allowing the young or even of even the largest families to suppress their elder siblings in prosperity. Ha, huh, that's a mouthful. <laughs> Absolutely going Hell's Guard. So, we should just honestly go as tall as we uh, possibly can. Um, hold on for one second, chat, dude. I am like dying. It's, it just got like super hot in here. Hold on. Sorry, my wife turned on the heat and I'm like dying. <sighs> I don't think there's such thing as a short Rogan. Oh yeah, um. Yo Bex, I remember a while ago you showed me there was a height difference. I'm looking that up real quick. Here it is. <laughs> oh my god. We're gonna be even taller. I know this is a different one actually. There was one that showed like... Here it is. Oh my god, this is it. The Reddit post. Jeez.
Okay, so <laughs> this is the one. Look at this. Smallest being 86 centimeters. And the highest being 230 centimeters. It's a big difference. So, um, damn, that is a big boy. What's the smallest he can be? 213. Just a reminder. All right, you can't wear hats. That's okay. I think I'll be all right with that. They don't make hats big enough for them. <laughs> How dare they? You know what? I'm just, since I'm going to be huge, I'm going to go as, as tall as I possibly can. Small clothes. And you know what? We're going to go as chiseled as we possibly can. Yeah. In color. So you look like, I don't want to look like too white, but Maybe that's a better, better one. Or maybe that. Yeah, I think that's probably better. Do I sound like... I don't know what changed, but from like downstairs to up here, I feel like I sound like a little different. I don't know why. Sounds the same here? Okay. Might be just me thinking. Whatever. Okay, that looks good. Hairstyle. Alright, here's a big one. Luckily, we can change this at any time. The one thing I really like about these guys, too, is they, um, finally, they have beards. Yeah. Can you do a full beard though? Beautiful. Perfect. I love it. Actually, I'm gonna go with this one. I've had this hairstyle so many times. I can't, I wonder if there really is somebody out there with this hairstyle on their character. There's gotta be, there, there has to be at least one person or even that, but oh, oh, I, I guarantee there is. I, I bet you, I wonder how many people chose this hairstyle. It was like, okay, that looks cool and never realized that there's this behind it. I wonder how many people that's happened to. Dora the Destroyer. Oh my god. That is fantastic. I'm not too worried about the hair because, again, like I said, like being able to change it at any time is going to be really nice. Yes. 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 How many times do you see that, huh? How many times? Never. 
Maybe, maybe a more. I think I might go with this one. Just go with the faux hawk for now. Air color, absolutely all black. Black every time, every time. Now we choose a face. Does the face change the style of uh, beard you can have? One of these has like a beard full. Yeah, here it is. <laughs> yep, that's what it is. The face. These guys are too young. They only have turn straps. Why does this guy have a thing on his nose? What is he, part cat? Wait, actually, why does he? Swiper nose swiping, spine crushing sound. <laughs> Take away that facial hair, he becomes the fist of the North Star character. Henry Cavill. I'm gonna role play Henry Cavill. Face number two. This guy. Look how close we can get up on his face. We can get right up in there. Wait, do they all have that thing on their nose? Why does he have this thing on his nose? Do they all have that, like, black? That's I. face I can't decide whether I want to do Where is it? here it is scars everywhere I can't decide whether I want to do this one or this one because this has a fuller beard but I also like like the little and that's kind of like an ugly face but I kind of like like the the calmness like a, or not an ugly, but it's serious, like very serious. But at the same time, I mean, that does, but I don't like that it misses that one piece in the center. Looks weird without a beard. I can't decide. I think I might do this one. Yeah, the beards are tied to the face type. Otherwise, like right now, I have all the face options enabled. I think I'm going to go with this. <laughs> That's gonna be so interesting. Yeah, cuz like I can't see that. I can't see that. Not for me. I can see this though. 
Let me see hairstyle. Now that we have our face. He lost his horns, but he got his gains. True. Now it's twice as, twice as hard with this book. <laughs> not wrong, not wrong. Yeah, I like how we'll be able to change to any one of these hair haircuts if I ever feel like changing it out. So I'm gonna stick with the faux hawk. Still confused why he has the black thing on his nose. But whatever. All right, jaw. One. I'm going to keep one. It's a nice middle. Eye shape. Probably keep one as well. Iris size. We'll do large. Does the other light skinned one also have nose hair? Um, maybe? I'm afraid I'm gonna lose my stuff if I go back. I'm going to Google it. Black nose. Huh. Oh no, it is the, uh, the hell's guard. That's why. Lore. Why do hell's guard Roganen have animal like noses and sea wolves have human like noses? Uh, I always saw it as a reference to early Galka's concept art, which had him lion men. Hellsguard inherited those nose while the sea wolves got their skin color. Hmm. That's okay. I'm gonna stick with the uh, stick with it anyway. It's part of him. They they'll know. They'll know me by my nose. That's it right there. They'll know me by my nose. One second, chat. Okay. Uh, eyebrows. I think I might keep the default eyebrows. Kind of like them. Nose. I'm going to stick with two. I like that one. Mouth. Let's stick with the default. Lip color, same thing, default. Facial features, all right, so now it's whether I wanna keep all the scars or not. Or if I wanna do any scars. I can see it without any scars. Scars or no scars? This face is the last thing the Shadowbringer sees before being snuffed from the plane of his existence. Maybe one scar, maybe this scar. Or maybe no scars. Or maybe that scar. I can't decide.
Maybe no scars. Let's try. Let's do no scars. I really wish, like, this would be a perfect body type to have, like, body tattoos. There we go. <laughs> Nice face tattoo. I actually wouldn't mind it. This face ta uh, face paint thing. But for now, I think I'll wait. Another important part. The voice. I think number three it is. <laughs> number three it is. So let's do it. All right, chat. Confirm. Confirm. Save. Absolute unit. Fourteenth son of the fifth umbral moon. The Scala. Mm. Yep, we're going to stick with that too. All right. I think we're good. I think this is time for me. Ready? I am satisfied. Yes. Wait, no! I'm just kidding. And there it is. And then there's the queue. I'm good on the queue. And that's it. That's it right there.